New details tonight on the car crash that killed a Chicago mother and daughter in St. Louis. They were run over by a reckless driver after leaving a Drake concert. Their family is now asking for help as the driver is facing charges in their deaths. CBS 2's Madabelle Gonzalez is live with what she's learned tonight about these women. Madabelle. Neighbors of the mother and daughter tell us they were extremely close, so it's no surprise to them that they went to this concert together. What they're so shocked and so saddened to hear about, though, is just how their night ended. Super fun, loving, energetic, just full of life and wanting to make memories and just have fun. That's exactly what Nicole Rivera says her 42 year old cousin Leticia Bracero and her daughter, 21 year old Alyssa Cordova, were doing Tuesday night. The two were leaving a Drake concert in downtown St. Louis, Missouri. When police say they were struck and killed by a driver, they've identified as 22 year old Monty Henderson. They say the suspect was driving at a high speed, ran through a red light, sideswiping a car before striking Letitia and Alyssa, who were walking in the crosswalk. But they were genuinely good people. Marlena McLaurin has known the mother-daughter duo for 15 years. She lives in the same Garfield Park multi-unit as they did. We would sit out on the porch during the summertime and listen to the fireworks, have our cocktail. We just enjoyed each other's as neighbors and they were a loving mother and daughter. It's the same way their relationship is described in a GoFundMe page apparently organized by family members. Letitia worked as a supervisor at a local bank while Alyssa, her only child, was going to college and working at a Starbucks. The post says Alyssa loved music concerts and although she was old enough to travel to concerts on her own, her mom would always escort her. So that should tell you that they were very close. Police say the suspect driver also T-boned another car in the crash. Four other people, including the suspect, were injured, but all expected to be okay. Letitia died at the scene while Alyssa was taken to the hospital before she too died. They're so much more than that. They're our family and we love them and we're going to miss them. And they're not just Two people who died, you know, trying to cross the street. But the family is raising funds to bring the mother and daughter home here to Chicago. Meanwhile, police tell us the suspect is facing multiple charges, including two counts of involuntary manslaughter. Reporting live from the control room, Maribel Gonzalez, CBS 2 News. Thank you, Maribel.